right, here we go. We're going to be predicting the next decimal in a sequence of decimals. So this first question asks us to complete the number pattern below. We have 3.8 followed by 4.7 followed by 5.6. And we need to predict what is the next number going to be. Okay, so we got to figure out what the pattern is. So what's the difference between 3.8 and 4.7? Let's figure that out. 4.7 minus 3.8. All right, so 7 minus 8, can't do that. I'm going to borrow 1 from here. I'll make that 3. So 17 minus 8 is 9. And then 3 minus 3 is 0. So 0 0.9 is the difference. Okay, how about the difference between 5.6 and 4.7? Let's figure out what that is. 5.6, 4.7. All right, again, 6 minus 7, we can't do that. We're going to borrow 1. And we got 16 minus 7, which is 9, and then 4 minus 4, which is 0. Okay, so we can see the pattern is pretty simple. Between each number, the number, the next number increases by 0.9. Okay, so from 3.8 to 4.7, that increases by 0.9. From 4.7 to 5.6, that increases by 0.9. So we know the next number is just going to be 5.6 plus... You got it, 0 0.9. So let's add these up. 6 plus 9 is 15. 1 plus 5, carry the decimal place. 1 plus 5 is 6. The next number in your pattern is 6.5. Great job.